Hello friends, today in this video we are going to discuss about the algal pigments which are present in algae. Okay, so in algae pigments are the means by which the energy of the sunlight is captured for photosynthesis. The particular wavelength of sunlight is captured by particular pigments and then this wavelength of sunlight is used for photosynthesis. Okay. So pigments, basically pigments are chemical compounds which reflects only certain wavelengths of visible light. This makes them appear colorful. So suppose chlorophyll which is also a pigment which, which uh, captured the sunlight at the blue range or the captured the wavelength of sunlight which is in blue range. Okay, that is the shorter wavelength of sunlight they captured and after capturing they reflect some of the lights at the lower wavelength or longer wavelength of light in the green region okay so that's why the leaves or the chlorophyll looks like green because they reflects the green light after capturing the blue or short shorter wavelength of light they uh, reflects the longer light that is the green lights that's why the leaves looks like green so pigments are chemical compounds which reflects only certain wavelengths of visible light this makes them appear colorful like flowers corals and even animal skin contain pigments which give them their colors okay so this is the main concept of pigments they capture the particular wavelength of light and they reflect some of the lights in different wavelength and that lights uh, color is reflected okay so more important than their reflection of light is the ability of pigments to absorb certain wavelength the more important is the which wavelength that pigment absorb according to their absorption of the uh, light they reflect their reflection is depends on their absorption of the light okay so a photosynthetic pigment is a pigment that is present in chloroplast of any photosynthetic organism and captured the light energy necessary for photosynthesis so photosynthetic pigments that is like um, chlorophyll is a pigment that is present in the chloroplast of any photosynthetic organism and captured the light or sunlight energy which are necessary for photosynthesis okay so since so there is as usually a need to produce several kinds of pigments each of a different color to capture more of the sun's energy because one pigments because one pigment only capture particular one wavelength of light so to capture different types of or capture more sunlights in of different wavelengths they have to they have to have a different pigments in their body in algae okay so that's why different types of pigments are present in algae so what are those pigments so algal pigments are present within plastid so in plastid four kinds of pigments are there so that are the chlorophyll xanthophylls carotenes and phycobilins so chlorophyll five types of chlorophylls are present in algae algal plastid that are the chlorophyll a b c and d and in this a b c d chlorophyll the a chlorophyll is present in all algae okay and xanthophyll 20 types of xanthophylls are present which gives the yellow or brown pigments yellow brown pigments in chlorophyce and pheophyce of algae in chlorophyce algae and pheophyce algae these xanthophylls are present which gives the yellow or brown pigments and in chlorophyll they gives the green pigments okay and the carotenes five type five types of carotenes are present in algae and out of five the beta carotene is present in most algae and the last one is phycobilins seven types of phycobilins are present in algae which one type is one type give the red red color that is the phycoerythrin type of pigment and one type gives the blue color that is the imparts the blue color that is the phycocyanin so this this type of phycobilins phycobilin pigments 
are observed in rhodophyce or red algae okay so here we can see that chlorophyll gives the green color xanthophyll pigment gives the yellow color and carotenoids gives the orange color and anthocyanin gives the red color okay so these are the all about the algal pigments okay thank you for watching this video